God made every person sacred, unique, unrepeatable, irreplaceable. We have this gift, this goal of unity. And it's not lofty, it's not nebulous, it's not impractical. Because I believe that if Jesus said it, he will do it. Do not let the circumstances of this world lie to you about who you are and what you were made for. You were made for love. You were made for communion. You were made for God. And you were made to live out relationship in the transcendent communion of the church. Tonight, no, not tomorrow, not the next week, tonight, give the Father permission to celebrate you. Give the Father permission to rejoice over you. Give the Father permission to love you. All of Christianity, what it is to be a follower of Jesus comes down to one question. Does God have your permission to truly see you as you are? Does God have your permission to truly know you as you are? And the one question that every one of us has asked this night and every night of our lives, does the Father have permission to love you tonight as you are?